Good afternoon. I'm Nick Foto. I'm the Deputy Program Manager for Port Restoration. I'm also the Finance Manager for the, for the project. Today we want to talk to you a little bit about uh, the new and latest addition to the port is our lighthouse or water tower. The reason this design came about is back when we uh, started the program, we were going to have to relocate tenants to all areas of the port, move people around, change the overall design, and one of the things that had to be moved was our old water tower. The blue water tower that was a, a focal point for the port for years had to be moved to a different location. When we made that decision to move it, one of the determinations that we had to make was whether we would go back with the old style uh, tank that we've seen for years, or we'd go with a ground level storage tank, or some, some combination, or something different. Well, after much discussion about the aesthetics of the port and what we could do to give back to the community, it was decided that we should at least entertain the idea of doing something a little different than the norm. So what we decided to do is take a tank and turn it up on its end and make a lighthouse out of it. Now on the surface that sounds easy, but what we did was instead of taking a tank and standing it on its end, the engineers had to go back and completely design a new type of storage tank to house the lighthouse on top. So what you have now is you have a custom designed tank with a, with a lantern room on top. The tank itself holds 250,000 gallons of water and it is part of our fire suppression system for the overall port. So if you notice down the front of the lighthouse, you'll see these nautical flags. The flags themselves spell out the word Gulfport, but the lighthouse itself is not a navigational aid. And for those of you who may not be familiar with the location of, of the lighthouse, it's located in the small craft harbor directly behind the Island View Casino. So with that, I'd like to say that this project has been very interesting to work on and be a part of. And with pride, we offer this new landmark to the city of Gulfport.